Welcome to our friends who have joined us through the magic of the internet. In this video, I will be demonstrating how I mount a 1.9 millimeter steer skin on a Tumba. The wooden disc just allows me to relieve a little bit of the tension. Next, I place the 20 inch diameter skin on the disc. 20 inches is generally enough for a 12 and a half inch Tumba. I always select skins that are free of any kind of defects, including cuts, and consistent in thickness. Next, I place the 304 stainless steel flesh hoop and crown on the skin to act as a guide for my clamps. The clamps allow me to maintain control of the skin with one hand while I tuck the skin with the other. Then I place the crown over my arm and head and gather the clamps. Then I bring the crown down over the skin and flesh hoop and tuck the skin, working it into the crown to create the pinch point. Now I move it over to the drum and attach the lugs. These are seven inch mounting lugs. Once I have the lugs attached, I just remove the clamps. Now I center the crown on the shell and pull the skin up and out to remove all the folds. Now I use the drill to apply tension to the lugs in a crossing pattern. I'm using my other hand to ensure that the crown is just below level with the playing surface. Next, I use a jig to ensure that the collar height is 
3 8 of an inch to start. Over the course of the drying period, I applied quarter inch turns to the lugs to arrive at a neck height of 3 4 of an inch. Next, I use a razor blade to create a small perforation in the skin to allow my modified carpet knife to fit in. Now I just trim the skin with the carpet knife and pull up and away, and it's like butter. The last thing I do is use the jig to make sure that I'm starting at 3 eighths of an inch all the way around the crown. 